Hey guys and welcome to Sahir and Nina. Now I'm showing you the last part of the sweatshirt dress that I made. It's finished now, as you might know if you watched my last video. And um, it was quite the job. Once again I went completely overboard and designed something with so many details and it took me a long time making it and finishing it and had some minor hiccups there, but I'm really happy with this result. Like, I think this is something I'm gonna get so much wear out of. As I already mentioned in the first video of this design, uh, the, when I designed it and, you know, it was all about the inspiration and stuff, that I wanted to film it in Athens, Greece. Because I was going there at the end of March, that's already passed now, I've already been there. I filmed the outfit there, we got some really amazing shots. Not that many, because it was really tricky, there's something I didn't take in account. Um, it is thick sweatshirt fabric and it was the most beautiful weather. We had the most amazing city trip. Uh, there's going to be a travel vlog coming soon as well. But um, I couldn't really wear it like the whole day walking around. And you know, when you're doing a city trip, you spend most of the time outside of the hotel. You don't come back to change all the time. So I wore it one evening, but then the lighting wasn't that good. And then I wore it one day behind the hotel. There's this little garden thingy. Anyway, uh, you will see the clips in the end of this video. And I did the best I could. <laughs> but I think for the Zurich weather, it's gonna be perfectly fine because it can be either worn with leggings or what I quite like as well, is like especially in spring, is like I don't mind bare legs because I don't really get cold in my legs or I don't feel it. I don't know, but either way. <laughs> and yeah, so I could easily wear it without leggings as well and still be really warm on the top because it is a sweatshirt. I wanted to change a few things also about this video and actually want to start filming how I do my makeup that is going to go together with the final look. So this is the first time I'm doing my makeup on camera. Please forgive me. Um, I'm trying my best. Let's see how this turns out. Now the styling of the dress for me was always going to be quite simple, there's not that much you need to add. Um, shoes, obviously, and <laughs> I got these uh, gorgeous like ankle boots that I extra for mainly that purpose dragged all the way to Athens with only flying with carry-on, but that's another story. Um, so they are from Public Desire, I believe. I will link them down below 
if I can still find them. They're like this light gray. It's pretty much the same color that is featured in the dress as well, which is one of the main reasons why I picked it. And it has this um, plexiglass heel, which I found quite a nice, and oh, and a little uh, silver detailing, which I found quite a nice um, addition to the whole thing. As a handbag, I used this clutch. I picked this up in a local store in Venice about two years ago. It used to come with a shoulder strap that broke. Uh, but it's this like rough leather. It's like a bit brushed, I would say, the texture. And it's woven. Let me show you the detail. And it just like flips over. It has a uh, one big pouch. It's like one big pocket. It has a small zip inside. No, there's still a receipt. Yeah. <laughs> Should we do what's in my bag? Anyway. And it has also a zipper in the back with a little pouch. I often just put my phone in there for easy access. It has this tassel at the end of the zipper. That's all the explaining I got to do. So I'm gonna move on to the lookbook now. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please give me a thumbs up if you did. And I'll see you again soon. Bye!